Live performances are returning to San Luis Obispo County this weekend, but new CDC recommendations mean there will be some adjustments. KSBY reporter Colette Neal has more on just how safe these in-person events are going to be. Colette? Good evening, Nina. On Saturday, the Performing Arts Center will reopen after over a year of hiatus due to the pandemic. And due to a lack of live performances, organizers tell me that they're seeing a big increase in demand for ticket sales. Who would have thought that it would have been 16 months of no live events? To prepare for the reopening, the Performing Arts Center invested in a new air conditioning system that allows a fair amount of fresh air for their audience. And this week, they plan on following the CDC's recommendation to require everyone to wear masks indoors regardless of vaccination status. We opted to require masking for all of our patrons for the foreseeable future, including tomorrow night's events. Also reopening for the first time since the pandemic is the Vina Robles Amphitheater with Joe Bonamassa on Saturday night. The venue says concert goers will experience touchless wherever possible, including ticketing, concession stands and bathrooms. And the Mid-State Fair has been hosting concerts from their main stage. The Mid-State Fair spokesperson says they will continue to follow the county and state guidelines, but not necessarily the CDCs. But are these protocols safe enough? The Delta variant is clearly much more contagious. If you're in an outdoor setting, it's still very clear that that's much safer than an indoor setting in general. With the Delta variant being partly responsible for a recent increase in COVID-19 cases in San Luis Obispo County, Dr. Brian Roberts says the best thing people attending these events can do is get vaccinated and wear a mask. The vaccine is an exceptionally good vaccine, but it can't stop the virus from going into you if you're in contaminated air. A mask can both help stop the source from pushing the virus out and block it from going into you. And local venues hope that patrons will continue to stay safe so that these live performances can keep the community together. There's no way you can replace that live experience with, with audiences and artists in the same room at the same time. Both the Performing Arts Center and the Vina Robles Amphitheater are having events set for December, and they're hoping everything goes according to plan. Live in San Luis Obispo, Coletno, KSBY News.